since October is set to tour with Hailstorm starting July 6th in Atlanta, and it comes in support of their just-released album, Life Scars Apologies. The band that had a rock-only hit with Guilty off their latest record, but with a roster packed with Katy Perry, David Guetta, and others, rock bands are usually left to their own to sink or swim. Vocalist Ben Graham talked about the release of Life Scars Apologies and the major distributor of their tooth and nail imprint, EMI, leaving them alone for better or worse. I think we're, we're just to the point where it's, could, could, it has the opportunity to turn into a career for us. You know, we've been full time for about four years now on the road. And just because you're full time doesn't mean it's, you know, everything's rolling. It's not it, you know, it's a ton of work and um, a ton of touring and shows, which we love doing. Um, but just over that time, you know, we've collected all these people around us to just to have this cool team uh, that believe in what we're doing and, you know, can help us get to that next step and really hoping that this record is, is the thing that, that does that for us. You know, I think we're just kind of right there on the verge of having that opportunity. Since October is climbing up the charts with The Way You Move, and Graham said it's atypical for the band and also for their genre of music. It's a different kind of song for us. Um, a lot of our stuff has been kind of dark, not like in a negative way, but just a darker kind of sound. And we wanted to do more of a upbeat, kind of happier kind of song, you know. And, and um, so we went that route. It was totally inspired by my wife. We, I've been married for almost eight years. Uh, it's been great, but uh, that's where the song came from, uh, about the day that we met and how we've worked through this and this and this and you know how we're going to continue to work through that. And I think a lot of time relationship songs are about what went wrong. and I mean, it just happens all the time, so everybody writes about it. So, you know, we decided let's write a song about you know, something that went right. Fans can hear since October get more aggressive with the show, which was one of the theme songs for WrestleMania 26, which took place a few months back. No can't be wrong. The perfect love is why I sing this song.